asking a dog to get off the sofa. If we stand directly in front of the dog, we might be asking them to come off, but our pressure is saying stay there because we're facing them head on. Some dogs are more pressure sensitive than others, so it depends on the dog. A better way to ask them to get off, you have two choices. You can back up and call them to you. See, I didn't even say anything to her and she came. Because I just opened up space for her. Another way to do it, another way to open up space, how about Yoma? Is to stand sideways and ask them to come off. Off here. And another way is to completely orient your body in the direction you want them to go. So I'm going to face my head forward because that's the way I want Puddin to come. And I'll ask her to come with me. Let's go. Good job. Something you don't want to do is grab the collar. Collar grabs can be very disconcerting for some dogs, especially if they haven't been acclimated to it. Plus, it's just really uncomfortable to grab them and yank them down because even though this is pretty low to me, it might be pretty high for a dog with stubby little legs. And imagine being dragged down from a wall without you being able to get your footing first. It's a little more kind to use a leash, but still extremely dangerous because you're not giving the dog a chance to get her footing. So don't even clip a leash and drag them off. And if you can't get the dog off at all, just wait them out. They'll get down eventually. And if you don't want a dog up there ever, when you get up from the sofa, just put some boxes or block the sofa somehow. 